Good afternoon, everyone. Good evening. Good morning. Uh, we're going to be putting together today a garbage commander, uh, garbage can toting system. And what that's going to do is it's going to utilize the ball hitch on the back of the four wheeler to be able to pull 96 gallon garbage cans. Uh, due to the snow and everything else, I've had to come up with another solution because I now have to tow my garbage cans just about a quarter of a mile, maybe a little bit less. Uh, installation looks pretty simple. The packaging was pretty decent. Uh, it was uh, just saran wrap, but uh, as the sticker on the package says, it's pay for our product, not for retail packaging. It was simple to open. I didn't have to go get wire snips or anything. I did use a little pocket knife just to get through there a little bit quicker. Uh, so let's go ahead and start putting this together. The instructions are really well put out. Uh, full color pictures. Uh, I really have no complaints. It seems like it's very simple uh, installation. So let's dive right in. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to jump right into putting the connector together. This here at the centerpiece is going to be what attaches to the ball at the front with the PTO pin. So we're going to take this and right in this order, it's going to go with your 7 16 bolt, flat washer, the arm. There are two sides to this. You want this uh, squared off edge. Then this will go into there. This will go underneath this, followed by a lock washer and a bolt. We're going to be utilizing 11 16 uh, box end wrench on this end to tighten that nut. And this is a uh, 5 eighths, I believe. 5 eighths on this side uh, to tighten and snug everything up. Uh, Honestly, it probably took me longer to set out all these things than it will be to put it together. So that's been put together. We put the PTO spring clip on here to help secure the load because we will be driving down some steep hills. The next part is to secure the first thing we built. So this is going to come up under, underneath here. It's going to be secured with a 3 8 bolt uh, is going to go in first through that through this piece of metal right here. A washer will then be placed in between here and the arm and then secured with a nylon nut or a locking nut rather. And this is going to be a pretty solid piece uh, once we put it all together. So we are going to do that now. Once again, I'm sorry I can't show you how I'm doing this, but I mean, this is very, very simple. Uh, to put this last leg together, we're gonna to be utilizing a 9 9/16 uh, box end wrench and a 9 16th ratchet. We're talking super simple installation. So this is a completed project here. We have the area where it attaches to the ball comes up here. Make sure this flat washer goes between this 90 degree piece of angle iron. We have our PTO clips here and on the other side another support. And I also got the two can can garbage commander toter, I guess you'd call them. It's, I don't know the exact name of it, but this allows me to tow two cans in tandem. Here it is installed. It took all of, I don't know, five seconds, maybe. Um, you literally push it around the ball, put the PTO thing in, then good to go. We'll throw the garbage can in on top now. So this is with the garbage cans installed. PTO clip on one side. The second set, second garbage can connected. And just so I don't create any headaches, I also bought some large bungees. And tomorrow we will video 
bring it down to the road. There we go. And the reason this needs to be in place is because of what's on the ground beneath these garbage cans, and that is severe patches of ice.